Hey guys, welcome to episode 11 of Football Manager 2016 Unemployed to the Top. So, today here we're playing Altringham at Moss Lane. A team that Sutton haven't played in real life yet from the moment I'm recording this. So, yeah, um, uh, yeah, um, yeah, we'll play Altringham today. Um, yeah, I think it's near the end of the season actually. Um, so yeah. yeah, it is. It's near the end of the season. But yeah, we play Ultringham. Um, and they've got a ball here. They kick it forward, but it goes to our player Saidu. And we get it forward, but their defence gets it, and then our defence gets it. Our midfielder playing it around. Um, Rowley here. Whips it into our manual. Manual whips it across, and Collins scores his ninth goal of the season. Good youngster to get on loan um, that we've had. Um, but yeah, um, here we've got the ball. Seydou he passes it to Joseph De Boyce, and then near back to Seydou, and Furlong scores. He's another good player to get on loan. Um, so if you're playing as around a team around this league, I recommend Collins and Bolo on loan. But anyway, um, Sidu's got the ball here. He passes it to Porter, to Joseph De Boyce, to Furlong, but he kicks it to their defence. But Rowley gets it back. Minchul to Porter. Furlong whips it through. Joseph De Boyce kicks it, but the keeper saves it. Then some more to Senate, and they whip it to the left of the wing here, and it gets whipped in, and it's a good header, but it goes off the bar. I've got a, another highlight just before half time. They whip it in, and it's off the post or crossbar again, and they whip it back in, but the chance comes to nothing. We say we're happy here. Paramore passes it, throws it in, and they throw it, but. But the keeper saves it. The keeper kicks it out after moving back and forwards like a dancer. Emmanuel here. It's Furlong to Collins. <laughs> to Joseph De Boyce and he scores. Joseph De Boyce's second goal of their season. They whip it in here. The player gets it just outside the box, he kicks it to the wing and the guy from the wing kicks it in the middle but they can't get anything out of this, out of this chance. The highlight carries on here, um, as we head, they head it back to us, Furlong's got it here, to pull it out, back to Furlong to Minshew, whips it forward, Rowley in the middle and Collins scores. So yeah, if you want a good young player, on loan in this division he is a recommended player but anyway um we've got the ball well we had the ball with Porter but Reeves has got it now he whips it to the wing and he passes it into the middle and Reeves has got it back again to Richmond Laurie now whips it in and it's a great save And they've got a corner here. He whips it in, but nothing comes of it. On the next highlight here, it's a throw in to their defender. He whips it all the way forward. And we pass it back to our keeper, and it gets whipped. And we, everyone's headers it forward. And C do to Porter, to the boys, to Collins. Collins has got a ball here. And Porter here to Mitchell. Mitchell kicks it to the wing. Rowley kicks it in. Joseph the boy scores a banger. Mix subs here. Ben Charlie on for Swain. And Taylor Crystal on for Collins. And we put Charlie Cooper on for Mitchell. It's 
Smith has got the ball here, he throws it to his teammate and he scores. So it's 5 1. And here it scrambles and the ball goes out, and that's the end of the game. The game finishes 5 1. I think we deserve that win um, of the way we played. Those were the results. That was the player in the team of the week. And we're at the Kingfield Stadium here against Woking. I'm pretty sure we played them way earlier in the season. But yeah, Liam Moz is out injured and Pinal is too. Uh, we bring in a new keeper. I think I might have forgotten to mention that. But I honestly can't remember. Um, yeah, Crud uh, Woking have got loads of good players. Jordan Slew. One of them and Bruno Andrade. Both used to play for Championship and Premier League oppositions. But yeah, Slew here. Slew kicks it in. For Woken. Jordan Slew with his 19th goal of the season. And that's all. That's all for this half. Here it's whipped in by Furlong. Header and Cole saves it. Cole kicks it out here and we header it. And here Emmanuel's on the ball. Pass it to Furlong. And Rowley kicks it in and it's a goal by Collins. His 11th goal already. It's crazy. We someone Ben Chorley for Rob Swain. We sub on Charlie Cooper for Max Porter and we sub on Taylor Crossdale for Collins. Let's we try and make subs here to get the last gasp winner. So you do here, Taylor Crossdale to Joseph the Boys to Cooper and the keeper saves it. Furlong whips it back in again, but they get to get the ball and they clear it away. But we've got it back and that's the other highlight. But yeah, we draw one all here. Jordan Slew and Aaron Collins. How unlucky. But yeah. Um, biggest score was well in. They beat Eastley 3 1, and our player gets goal of the month. And I congratulate him on the goal. And I show the goal here. It's against Gateshead if you needed a reminding. Here it is. As you can see that's a great goal. And he's doing a dab in the middle of it. <laughs> but here we've got Braintree. And Gateshead have got Boreham Back at Hayes Lane. Here's the team line up. And I'll leave you with it. So their player, key man is Kenny Davis. And here in the 31st minute, we've got the ball, we're passing it about everywhere. Porter kicks it to Seydou. Seydou here kicks it to Porter. Furlong's got the ball, he whips it through, Emmanuel shoots. And it's a goal in the 32nd minute. Emmanuel with his 17th goal of the season. Amazing. <laughs> to get that kind of goal margin. <coughs> Especially for me. But the keepers held the ball for a long time. He kicks it forward and they they get the ball back their key man here passes it and they get it through Strutton manages to take a shot away but the keeper saves it here it's half time 1-0 and we make subs here in the 70th minute Ben Chorley on for Rob Swain and then in the 75th minute we put on Ali Fazzini for Lee Mitchell 
in the 75th minute here we get the ball but they manage to get it back they kick it forwards they've still got the ball here Strutton parlor to Walker Strutton gets it back he whips it to Davis their key man and our player gets it back and we're through here with Collins can he score no he can't he hits the post and in the 79th minute here we go here to take the last side played the cross out on for Collins but here they get the ball back after our keeper kicks it out and now they're through with Stratton on the wing and yeah what a save by our keeper and that's the end of the game so we say a very nice victory well done because we managed to get the 1-0 win Still top of the league, just we just get top of the league. But Coombs comes to us and says we want playing. He wants playing time, so I, I told him he can he can go. And here we play support away. Um, and yeah, um, here's the player roles. We sort the player roles out. Um, and yeah. Dicky man is Gary Jones. Um, I don't really know much about Southport. I've never something I don't think I've ever come up against them. So, um, but yeah, um, they have it in their defence. Thompson kicks it forward, Symes, and Swain tackles him. The boys tackles that other guy, but they still got it back here. Jones buzz it to Hartley. Hartley whips it through. But Green cannot score the goal. Here in the third, just before the third minute, Symes here, he's got the ball. Green gets it. Symes, Hartley, Jones to the other Jones. <laughs> um, he's got the ball here. He passes it to Hartley. Hartley kicks it to the left of the wing. Beasley here kicks it forward and Hartley misses by a, a mile. Serve of minute here. Game's all action, but we've got the ball here. Collins, Manuel, they slide tackle, but Rowley's got the ball here. He passes it through. Collins got it furlong and he scores. So after all their attacks, we're 1 0 up here at Hager Lane, I think it's called. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, um, so they go on the attack here. Jones here, not to be confused with Gary Jones, and this kicks it. <laughs> um, and Green here, Gary Jones to Jones on the wing. Symes kicks it in, and it's one all here at Southport. And here Jones kicks it forward, Symes Burns has got it, and Gary Jones here passes it to Hartley Green, and Symes couldn't make good of his chance. But here Gary Jones whips it in, and we get it clear. Hartley here whips it to Green, and then they kick it out, or we kick it out. And it's 1 0 here. Um, I said keep going here we're forward with the ball Emmanuel here he kicks it straight at the keeper and they get it cleared Burns here whoops it in couldn't make anything of their chance but they've still got the ball here Burns again can he whip it through he can and we get it cleared again but they've got the ball still they come forward again and I think I go attacking from this point. Um, and here Jones, but Fazzini has tripped him up while already with a yellow card. So we've got action here in the late half. Um, so we put Porter back. This is usually what we do when a player gets red carded. We usually put somebody back. So yeah. Um, uh, um, and yeah, they get a free kick and the header gets cleared for a corner. And here they've got a corner 
and for some reason I decided to make this up in the middle of the highlight. Ben Shortly on for Rob Swain. And Taylor Cross that on for Aaron Collins. And yeah, nothing happened anyway. Thompson follows it here to green. Hickford gets it back. He tries to whip it forward to Crossdale, but Thompson's got it for sure. Coglian messing about the ball here, kicks it forward. Nolan burns. Jones has got the ball here, whips it forward to Joyce, and Joyce scores. Um, and yeah, we're 2-1 we're down here. We kind of deserve to be ready, so I'll push Porter forwards, Rowley forward, and Seydoux forward, and Chorley forward. This is what I do when I panic <laughs> and try and get a goal. But yeah, I put Cooper on here. Um, and here, 88th minute, late on. Coglin kicks it, throws it forward to the defender, but they've got the ball up front here. Bear burns and Symes kicks it in the goal. So we go from 1 0 up to 3 1 down. Can't say we uh, um, don't deserve it. We, play, we let our chances go. Um, so yeah. Um, yeah. So without a chance to score, that cannot be helped. But anyway, um, Fazzini's banned for a match here. And he says the final was unfair, blah, blah, blah. We give him all that bullshit. But yeah, I'll leave you guys with the last bits. Um, and yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this episode. And I shall see you guys later.